Oh yeah, smooth again. Yee! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Go Go Gates! Go Go Gates! Finale here! Well, hopefully. <laughs> I mean, well, this is by far the most difficult one, but then again, that's what I said about the match with Kid and... Mm, you've seen how that one went. <laughs> Alright, so the Lynx Club is, of course, the final one. And again, you've got to get three of these cleared in a row. And here we go. I don't think I'll be able to make the green in one shot here. But I'm going to try and top spin it up the slope. Maybe that'll work. I'm not counting on it. No, the slope is just too heavy there. But that's okay, because all I have to do is get par on each of these, and I will be a happy camper. That was way too high of a trajectory. <laughs> uh, I'll hit it over there, and then let the slope funnel it down. That was under hit, so I'm going to top spin it. Go ball, go! Go ball, go! Chipping, chipping, chipping! <laughs> nah, not this time. It's a little too far away for comforts on the chipping. Alright, now this one... Oh, ooh, this one. Oh yeah, this one. I gotta go between those two gates in the middle more importantly than any other because of the way that they're set up. Because they're like slightly overlapping in their angle. Yeah. So I gotta position myself really good here. Preferably over there. Down over in front of the bunker, not in the bunker, preferably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't care if I go through the first gate just yet. I just want to be in position to go through these gates right here. Uh, can I get away with going through all the gates? Like, can I really? I've got to try it. <laughs> and, oh, slight miss hit there. But I don't think it'll matter that much because of my lie. Oh my, Arceus. I got through all four of them in one shot. That was literally the perfect position. Alright, so then I'll just aim right for the flat spot and call it a hole, I guess. <laughs> because no way I'm going to miss the putt on such a flat terrain, so yeah. And there we go. And I even got it nice and close. Although that's kind of optional when you're on a flat piece of terrain. <laughs> Alright, one more. It's a par 5, 4 gates. Uh, I forgot how this one goes. There's zigzag everywhere I see. Well, uh, well, the first one's obviously I gotta hit way down there, but I gotta get through the first gate, of course. So I gotta aim like just outside of it and let the wind push me into the gate, because 22. Oh shoot! Well, that might not hurt me too much, because 22 mile per hour wind is gonna do that. Okay, so that's. Good for one shot, I suppose. And now I gotta get back ooh, the other way. Gotta do some curvature action here. And not get in the heath. Uh, how about... How's that? Ooh, that's really cutting it close. Um, uh, how about I go like six iron and super backspin? That's probably my best choice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, I got through the first one. And control, control, no heath. Thank you. <laughs> and now what I should be able to do is hit with a fade left to right onto the green in theory. You know, through the... Oh, no, I guess I can't do that. Well, looks like I'm struggling to get up and down again. <laughs> well, it is the hardest one, so... Can't really blame me for that. I'm just gonna hit off to the left side of the green here, and wherever it goes, it goes, and then I'll hit to the flat spot in one putt. In theory. <laughs> How about there, and a smidge of backspin, because the wind's gonna pull it forward. Ooh! <laughs> so I figured I would control its landing. The, I think the pin controlled its landing better than my backspin did, but there we go. Completed the hardest one. You're gonna get a level up or two. Okay, just one. Uh, drive distance. Yeah, I guess. The rest of the stats are pretty good. I never considered the possibility that one person would be able to clear all four courses. 
based on what I've seen, you're an all-around great golfer. I can handle any course you play. Yeah, that's that's pretty true <laughs> for this game. Oh, hey, by the way, take this. It should be really useful for a golfer like you. And sure enough, we got another muscle drink. Let's power up somebody. Her, I guess. There we go. Because as I said, her stats are... Uh, I shall, because her stats kind of lower the way that I don't want them to be for my preferences. But now uh, that you did this, you may challenge any course as you please. But I'm not going to do that, so I just hit the B button to get out of there. Do you have anything to say about... Oh, there we go. Yeah, I knew that dialogue would change eventually around here. <laughs> yes, he is. What? He's not the groundskeeper for those courses. What? Oh, forget it. <laughs> All right, out and about now. I'm going to go and flop over to here now. Grand opening of the brand new Next Gen Epoch Golf Mini Bar! That is a mouthful of a place. But so, what is this place? So it's definitely a golf place, as you would expect in a golf game. Tee off on this at, at this part four tee box and go for hole three's green. You need to hole out with at least a seven. You know what? This is crazy. I'm not really big on impossible golf. Is this like a practical joke? <laughs> oh, bro, and even I can't score a seven or better on this weird three in one hole. So let's give this a try. Yes, I would like to. There's three difficulties here, and I'll give them a shot. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do the last one without a higher drive distance, but. We'll see here, because this is really, really long. 785 yards long. <laughs> I'm gonna try and cut off as much of this hole as I possibly can, and practice for future difficulties, I guess you could say, because getting in the hole in seven is not that hard, but getting in the hole in five, which is what the hard one will in entail you to do, is much, much harder, so. Oh, I mishit that one, so there goes my power for the minigame. Well, I'm already relatively close, because I'm starting the par 5 third hole here. <laughs> and yeah, see this, it just keeps on going! <laughs> you can also cut off some stuff by using that, but I don't think I have the drive distance for that. I'm just gonna, ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, oh yeah, I don't have the power, dang it! Uh, how about I... Try and... No, that won't work. It'll always put me in the rough or in the trees or in the water. I'm gonna have to plop myself down here. And hope that I bounce up the slope and onto that plateau without any sort of ire. One bounce, two bounce... Nope, that's gonna be ire. <laughs> uh, oh, well, no, that's actually usable. But yeah, I can actually tell now that I won't have to increase my drive distance at all. I'll be able to make it in five. Uh, it's just a matter of positioning that last shot a lot better than what I did there. Uh, that's gonna hit the slope. It's not gonna hurt me or anything like that. Ooh, maybe it will! Oh jeez, my feet are wet! <laughs> I didn't think it would bounce that far, but... Well, it did, and... And can I get it in within three shots from there? I think I can. <laughs> so there we go. And I gotta ask that guy if he's really even a pro. <laughs> and there we go. So yeah, as, it, as you've seen, it's not that difficult, so you don't get that many experience points for it. And increase the height. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, he's so happy. Wow, he finished the, the seven strokes. You're gonna go far. Sometimes part is five, sometimes it's seven. This is one wacky to play the way to play the game, that's for sure. Hey, thanks a bunch. Come back and play anytime you want. I will. Uh, yeah, give it another shot. Gotta, gotta live up to your name, pro man. Alright, can I just... Uh, I don't want to leave the area and... I do have to leave the area and come back. I hate that sort of game design. Because <laughs> you know that the player is just gonna leave and come back anyway. Alright, now I gotta do it in six. For the normal and best of luck. <laughs> Again, I'm gonna be trying to cut off as much of it as, as I possibly can because this is nearly 800 yards in distance. And for the uh, expert one, I'll probably, I mean the hard one, I should say, I'll probably have to not lose my power at all through the entire dealio 
Like, I lost my power there, so I probably lose my opportunity to get it in five shots, but it'll be just fine for normal. Um, I'm actually in a better position than I was the last time. Okay. So... So, this should actually be doable then, even without the power. You know, getting it in five? Uh, but we'll see. I, I, it, it, just these first two are mainly practice for the main event of the last one, anyway. Anyway, four iron's gonna come in low. Wind is also gonna make it come in lower, so backspin it is. Hitting just below, before the green. Ooh, that really made it die down. Well, well, well. Let's see if I can get it for five anyway. Can I get it for five? Ah! Oh! <laughs> it was worth the shots. In fact, it will have to be done mandatory-like on the hard version. But there we go. Power 6 is complete! It'll be pretty even when I finish this off. <laughs> Look at that! 153 for each. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Yes, yes, yes. You're welcome. Okay, I gotta leave and come back. <laughs> yes, I am. Alright, now this is the one that may give me a bit of ire here. It may take me a couple tries to get it, because you've seen I didn't make it in five of the first two tries, but who knows? I could make it this time. I'm just gonna rip it as far as I can, and I just noticed that I lost the power immediately, so what I should probably do is restart from the start just to be safe so I can get as much power as I can off of my shots, so yeah, let's start it over. Just make sure you get, give yourself the best opportunity, and you also might want to do some wind manipulation as well, like if you don't have as high drive distance to be able to do it the way that you would want to do it, you could choose to shuffle it around like restarts and redo it to get the wind in your favor for the hole, but I don't think I'll need to do it for this particular run through the game, but that is something that you could do to manipulate your luck. And yeah, I'm in incredible position right now. Look how much distance I've got on the hole now. And... And look at that, still not losing a power shot, and the wind will keep me out of trouble. By trouble, I mean the tree or the water. <laughs> and there we go. I don't hope that hill won't be in my way. Oh no! Oh no! Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh. Restart. <laughs> I guess I end up in trouble after all. Uh... Anyway, try it again. In theory, I will eventually get it. It's just a matter of getting myself all together in a single run. And this, with the wind in my face, will probably require more power than ever. And I'm not gonna try and hit it quite as far as I did before on the third shot. <laughs> because that just got me in all sorts of trouble. So I just want to get myself plopped up. Yeah, somewhere around there will be fine. I'll even control it with backspin. How does that sound? Oh, I miss hits. Well, uh, well, it might not matter that much. We'll see in just a second here. Uh, yeah, 185 to the hole. Got a tree in my way. Uh, okay, here we go. This is the shots. The shot that will make all the difference, probably. Wind is with me. Ever so slightly. And... Super backspin. Here we go. The shot of champions. Mm, yeah! <laughs> that's that's a shot to make history. <laughs> and easy little putts for five. Okay, maybe that won't make won't make, won't make history, but still, still that was a fun shot. <laughs> Uh, improve the impact and control. There we go. Woo! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! And guess what? Since I cleared it all, I get another special ticket! Well, custom ticket B for that house in the middle of the world and stuff like that. So, uh, if you would like to... Well, well, hold on. <laughs> 
Uh, first off, I should actually reach out with people. Uh, thank you, thank you. Oh, okay, same dialogue there. But okay, now as I was saying, if you would like to, you could play any of the difficulties again, just like you could at the club slots, the go-go gates. So this mini game is open to the public. Well, by public I mean you completely. And with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I will see you in the next parts.